doors. Right off the bat. Chairs. Those were chairs uh, given to me at the apartment storage unit clean out. And here's our start for today. Nice giant mailbox. Yeah, bit of metal. So there's another scrapper in here and I thought about, nope, 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 well done. Thought about just leaving here and going out to Sturdivant, but I really wanted that to stay together so I could use this as leverage up there. Okay, you stay put. I just saw him um, head out that way. So that means he thinks that I've covered this area, but I haven't. Look at that. Yeah, we're gonna take that. Um, I am going to the storage unit, so, which is right here. Oh man, gotta dig deep. Oh, it's just plastic. <sighs> okay, well, uh, I'm going to the storage unit, so how clever. Have to get the plate off to get inside to take this off of the wood. But look at that, there's some bare bright. There's the bare wire, sweet. You know what, I this is part and parcel of what I like to find. When I'm, when I'm running the streets. I have lots of this, but in this size. So that is pretty cool. Yeah, the storage unit's like uh, two blocks over that way. Oh, wait a minute, there's a scooter in there, but it's buried. We're gonna get it, but I gotta. Oh, this is all plastic and napalm, so it's light, light stuff. But yeah, I should be able to get that out without having to take any more out. Yeah, a little razor scooter. All right, back in you go. Yep. Those of you who have not seen all of my videos, if you're new to my channel, I often talk about styrofoam as napalm, and there's a reason for it. This stuff, oh, there's a piece of plastic fell out of there before I got here. Um, this stuff, if you break it into little chunks, careful. There we go. If you break it into little chunks and mix it with like chunks like this, mix it with gasoline. <laughs> that is homemade napalm. I wouldn't recommend doing it. It's, I don't know if it's legal or not. I don't do it, but I just know that you can. And we get a full chair and something else. A couple something else. We'll take it all. A gentleman just put it out here and I was driving by. And I slowed down and he looked. I said, may I recycle it? He said, yes. I said, thank you, sir. So it's the start to our Friday morning. That is what? Oh, that's a gas-powered 
I got one of those already in there. Let's see the other thing. I'll take take this. I'll look at that in a minute. I might have to stay on there. So it looks like it's bolted on. So that's okay, we can take that. Knock some of the plastic out of it, right? 200 miles per hour. <laughs> uh, uh. Kind of like my love life. 200 miles per hour. Chair morning, huh? Big time chair morning. You stay while this one goes. There you are. Cool. Oh, <laughs> okay. I'm gonna have to start putting stuff in through the back now because this is getting ridiculous. Yeah, come on. Stacking it in here, I'd have an easier time. God dang it, come on. Come on. Oh, it's all right there. This is not amusing. Chairs. Thank you. Lots of chairs. Yeah, there's a air tank in there too. I'm not gonna goof with that enough. It should go over the top of everything. There we go. There's some metal. It's not much. But uh hey. I'll test it over at the van. I got the magnet up there, right? I wonder if that's brass. It might be. Not sticking. That's steel. That's steel. Um, leaves are not magnetic, nor is grass. Probably cast aluminum. I see one long lamp in there. Maybe a cord on it. Yeah. Ah, pinchies. Ouch. That's not fun. Yeah, it's all that's here. Everything else is carpet, cardboard, and stuff like that. Added to the pile. A little bit of brass, right? How about that? That's the ticket. A little bit, whoops, a little bit of brass. At least not all of it. Okay, what are you, what are you doing here? going to be a mess, folks. Sp 
springy. Oh, come on. So my plan is to finish up the street run today. Do a little dumpster pick in the morning. Is this metal? Yes, it is. Do a little dumpster pick in the morning. Oh, come on. In the morning, and then uh, that's plastic. And then make a run to the scrapyard. So that's what I will be doing. Finally, something with some substance to it. Now, many people might not, but I consider this uh, an appliance. It's used to cook food, to heat stuff up, water, whatever. So, let's put it in there so it's easiest to get the cord. Right there, that's all right. Come on, baby. That's the ticket. Yeah. I'm wondering if uh, uh, it's a it's a situation where I've got so much to do. I'm not overwhelmed by any means, but I got I got one problem, and it's a personal thing. Or I should say a flaw. I need to stay off the streets for a couple of weeks and just get stuff torn apart instead of goofing around like this. I mean, yeah, you have to go around to find this stuff, but thank you, folks. You have to drive around to find this stuff in the first place, but I got so much I have to deal with. And with as little as I'm finding and as pricey as the gas uh, per gallon is, it behooves me to uh, stay off the street for a couple of weeks. So I have to do that. I have to discipline myself to do that. at the scrapyard. <laughs> I'll take the whole thing. I'm allowed one, so I'll take it all. It's kind of heavy. And I'll take the cord off it. Put that up for a okay. Board. Nothing come out. Come on, nothing. Oh, sweet. Right. Yeah, this bugger is heavy, folks. <laughs> this is heavy. Yeah. Okay, alright. That just happened. And now stuff did come out, and you are staying back here. You're not riding in front with me. Joker, get, oh brother, that's not good. That's what I wanted to have happen, so I could kind of, maybe. <clears throat> so, jeez. Okay, no scrapyard run today, folks. It is already 80 degrees outside. It's only like 6.20 in the morning, so. <clears throat> but I'm gonna check some more dumpsters. And then uh, call it a day.
Boy, I'd really like that, but it's attached to a counter and a sink. And yeah, I can't do that. I'm not digging that out. So, no, no. Nope, and finally at the apartment where I live. Nope. Whew. Nope. My love to all of you, each and every one of you. Once again, thank you for watching. Remember, 2,500 subs means a contest and one person, one person only, will win a fabulous, fabulous gift. All right, everybody have a wonderful, wonderful day.